Welcome to another video. This time I'll be doing iPhone 8 LCD replacement. The first thing you do is, as usual, open the bottom two screws. Second step is you just Don't go more than that because just the cable you don't want to break it even if you do since it does you know it will just break the screen nothing else but the screen is broken we don't have to worry about anything but you have to worry about this cable which is the your piece speaker so you don't want to go higher than that and that's it once you're done open it like book not all the way more not more open than this but now you get your regular screw flip Phillips screw and open these four one two three four And open three over here. Let's see. If you ever lose a screw, don't worry about it. You will find it afterwards. It's not a big deal. Now unplug this too. Unplug the battery. Usually unplug the battery the first thing you do. Now let's see. Connect, connect. Six screws, top right, top three, bottom three. Once it's open this much, then you just go ahead and One of the most important thing is the home button. So what you do is you find something very thin and you go underneath this. Once you're in there a little bit, So if you mess up the home button, the finger pin will not work. So we're done. You can take out the most important part. Now the new screen, uh, here we go. So it looks like it already has a metal plate. What we do is we remove this plastic, insert the button, then let it go. Come over here and press this up a little bit will go now you can just connect it so if you have to move the bottom part right left so I can connect yeah you can do it now put this on there as far as this you don't have to worry about all the screws even if you put one or two screws connect but the main screw you need is on top of the home button one, 
two. As long as you have two, it'll be good. But let's put the rest of the screws. I'll remove the plastic. This part. Pay attention, everyone. So what you do is first you connect put this two in the holes one of them in the hole and the other connector now besides that now we just bend it because you see it wants to bend already just bend it it's supposed to go where it's supposed to go just kind of play around a little bit move it right left right until it feels like it's fitted in where it's supposed to Now you take this, the gold part matches the gold in the bottom, get on top of that and put this on there. Now the metal part, however you take it out, just put it back the same way. Remember, write it down or rewind the video. Now there's six screws, three top and three bottom. We'll start with three top. That's it, done. Last but not least. Connect this. And connect the second one. Well, this is, let's remove the battery connector out of the way. Those two are connected. Now we leave this on the ground or hold it up. Let's connect the third thing. So as you can see the shape, it is going like this. It doesn't go the other way. I mean there are times I put it upside down, but this is how it goes. And now let's connect the battery. And that's it. The rest of it you don't have to watch if you don't want to watch, but basically wherever you take a screw from you just put it back there. That's it. As simple as it can get. Sometimes it gets frustrating to you guys probably when the screw doesn't go there, but it's okay. Take it out, put it back. The middle is a big screw. The bottom is another big screw. No, the bottom, sorry. The end. And now let's put this. So there's no way you can make a mistake with a screw because the bigger screw will not fit the little ones. And we're done. Now let's close it. When you're closing it, just, just be gentle with it. Connect the bottom first. Come from both sides. I'll, no, just don't overdo it. Press the power button and see if it works. Okay, now it's working. We're good. Now I'm going to go ahead and put the bottom two screws. And we'll test the touch. Then after that, that's it. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe. Video quality will get better over time once I have a little bit more subscribers. So I can apply more effort and time into this.